Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we're going to be doing something a little bit different. Well, actually it is quite different because as you guys have seen, I've only been doing beauty things on my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be introducing something a little bit different. I'm going to be doing fashion, which is actually what I've always done. I'm, I am a fashion blogger. Why am I out of breath? <laughs> Okay, I have been buying some pieces, oh, that word, oh my gosh, I can't deal. I've been buying some pieces here and there. So yeah, I've been doing some online shopping and some in-store shopping and I just thought I'd show you guys, almost like a haul video, so I thought I'd just show you guys some of the things that I bought recently. I really enjoy watching other girls do this, like, this is probably, to me, whenever I see haul video, I'm like, click load video watch like 50 to 20 minutes of a woman just showing me what she bought i don't know it just excites me so i thought i'd actually do one on my youtube channel and yeah so if you want to see my whole video please keep on watching okay so you are going to notice quite a trend in color scheme um i think if you check out my instagram why is my light doing the weirdest thing right now so if you notice that my Instagram feed has been very white and pink and grey. I'm going through a little bit of a, I don't even know if it's a phase or what it is, but I've been enjoying the whole pink and white and grey kind of a feel to my outfits. So you're going to be noticing a lot of those colours. So the first item that I have is a beautiful, like a jersey, people will say a jumper, lol. But it's like this really long what type of sleeve is this i can't explain this sleeve but it's like a it's quite an oversized jersey and it's again pink and it's got this really cool color um i'll insert a picture maybe somewhere over here where you can actually see how the collar looks on me it's got like this straight kind of a collar going from each shoulder and i've been really really enjoying that like i've only worn this once and I really like how comfortable it is and it's not like too warm it's just like the perfect amount because I wear vests under it so yeah I've been really enjoying this um, color and I like the sleeves as well that it's got like this cuff I'm not really a cuff kind of a person I just feel like it doesn't really I don't know it really irritates me but this actually didn't irritate me so this is from the Archie and Co by Cotton On it's I got mine in an extra small um, but it's still really like baggy and um, that oversized kind of a look. And Cotton On is actually having a 25% off all the knitwear. So I scored one of these because I had a Canal Walk voucher as well for 200 Rand. So I used my Canal Walk voucher and then it came to like 400 and then again the 25% off. So I got this for like 210 Rand guys. Like this really, really good quality jumper slash jersey, whatever you call it. So next on our list is again pink. So I got this blush color jersey. So I posted this on my Instagram once before and I have been loving this jersey. It's this ball sleeve kind of a vibe to it. And ball sleeve is really in for the season and actually autumn, winter. It was for summer as well. So I definitely believe in the hashtag long live the ball sleeve. <laughs> so yeah, I've been really enjoying this jersey. I got it on Superbulous. There is a brand that I'm absolutely obsessed with. It's called the Daily Friday. And I'm sure a lot of girls from South Africa would actually uh, know the brand because whenever you're on Superbulous, that's probably the one that everyone goes to. They've got really good quality clothes and it's actually not that expensive. The delivery from Superbulous was really quick. I think I bought it um i bought it this sunday and it came on the monday so that's a winner in my book so next on our list is it kind of looks pink but it's actually like a nude blushy kind of a color um so this is a crushed velvet off the shoulder top i haven't worn this yet i literally just took it out the packet right now this is how it looks it's like an off the shoulder kind of a vibe and I got this off of Zando. I don't know, I think it was like 200 and something rand. I've been eyeing this for quite a while. Every time I go on Zando, I don't buy anything. I just look at it, at the stuff. And I was like, I really like that top. And it only comes in a small, not an extra small. Well, it comes in small, medium, large. But I'm usually an extra small because I'm quite small on top. 
So I was like, oh, they're not going to have an extra small. It's not going to fit me. But I took that risk and I was like, you know what? Let's just take the small and see how it fits. Because the model also looked kind of like my size. So I ended up taking it and it fits like a glove. It feels so comfortable. It's not loose. It's not tight. It's just like perfect. I really, really like this fabric. It's like crushed velvet kind of a feel. I really, really like it. I haven't worn this yet, but I think I'm going to wear it with like white jeggings and black jeggings and maybe even like culottes or something like that. So I'm quite excited about this. Um, I wear it like with a leather jacket or like... I don't know, change coat or something, you know. So the next item, again, is pink, believe it or not. <laughs> so this is a coat that I cannot even show you, but I wanted to show you the color. This coat I have been wanting for a while. Um, I got it from Superbulous. So Superbulous has a brand, Misguided, which is like a UK brand, I think. And they actually stock misguided items and i saw this jacket and i was like oh my gosh it's pink and it's beautiful so the quality is so stunning it's like really good quality you can feel it's like that molten coat kind of kind of a vibe and the sleeves are also just plain pink everything is very plain it's got a waterfall kind of a finish to it and i was so excited to get this coat i have been telling everybody whenever they like like people who don't even ask, like my brother for example, I'll be like, oh, this coat, this coat, it's from Misguided. And you'll be like, eating, like, I didn't ask you. Like I was chilling with my friends and I was wearing this coat and I'm like, oh, this coat, yeah, it's from Misguided. And they're like, don't care. But I'm so excited about this coat, it's like the dumbest thing that I do. I got it in the UK 6 and it fits like a glove, it's a little bit too big for me. But I quite like it because I wear thicker jerseys underneath and then it just, it's like the perfect piece to go over my jerseys and things like, you know, when you just want to drape something over your shoulders or yeah, something like that. I quite like this coat. And also I'm short, so this coat sits by, I can't even explain it, maybe like just a little bit above my ankle. So it is quite long on me, but I like it. I wear it with sneakers, I wear it with boots. I wear it with uh, my loafers, which I'm going to show you in a bit as well. So yeah, I've been really enjoying this coat and the color is stunning. There's a gray one from Superbulous that I want as well, um, but it's not from Misguided. I think it's Daily Friday as well, um, but they don't have my size. Um, it's also a molten coat. Really want to get it, but like I said, they don't have my size. So I just have to wait, I guess, until they get new stock or maybe I find a similar one. I don't know. Okay, so next up are my Gucci knockoffs. Hello. So these are from Ruby, which is a brand with ink cotton on. So I got these from Access Park for like 150 bucks. I think they were 500 rand. And then, you know, Access Park marks everything down because they're always having like a sale. So this was 150 rand. On social media, I get a lot of attention from these shoes and it's always good attention. No one's ever said to me like, your shoes are ugly or those are weird or I don't like those or whatever. People always say like, oh my god, you pull them off so nicely and things. Thank you so much for that, by the way. But I know for fact Lorenzo hates these shoes. He's told me straight out, I hate your shoes. But I really, really like them. I love this gold detail over here. I feel like this just adds like a little classy kind of a vibe to it. And it's got a little bit of a, like a, this flap thing here i like that so much i really really like these shoes i feel like they add a little bit of class to your outfit so what i've been wearing quite often lately is like black jeggings with these and then maybe like a plain top t-shirt kind of a vibe and then that pink jacket i just showed you from misguided so i've been loving these shoes i kind of want to get them in silver as well but lorenzo is like the black is hideous and i imagine i'm gonna wear silver as well like uh. But like I always say, and I tell this to every single person, I told a girl in Karawak as well yesterday, he's not wearing the shoes, he's not wearing the boots, he's not wearing the top, you are. And if you like it, you wear it. So that's exactly the mindset that I have when it comes to my shoes and all my outfits actually. I really like these shoes and I want to get them in leather as well, so I know they'll last. I know Spitz has a pair as well. Um... I think it's a Carvela one. It also has like this buckle. It's a bit sharper, like more pointy. I know Akila has a pair and she's like, we need to be twinsies like in those Carvelas. And mm, 
I might just do it. I like them so much. So yeah, I've been loving these shoes and I feel like it's really sort of like a statement, but in a subtle kind of a way. Another thing I want to say about those shoes is the reason I got those is because I have a absolute obsession with the girl named Samantha Maria. If Lorenzo is watching this video, I know you're going to laugh at me because you always laugh at the fact that I'm obsessed with Samantha Maria. To be dead honest with you, I just feel, I feel like we have this connection, like I know her. I don't know if you've ever had the connection with someone online, like maybe a blogger, a YouTuber. Like whenever they speak, you're just like, yeah, like I get you, I get what you're saying. So I have that connection with Samantha. Whenever she uploads a video, I'm like, I'm there like a bear, like I really want to watch her videos. And the way she dresses is a little bit weird. Sometimes I'm like, oh no. But when I saw her wearing, I think she was wearing them with culottes and um, like those distressed jeans and like mom jeans and stuff. I was like, I really like those. Like she is the one with the whole floral embellishment kind of a vibe, which I actually wouldn't mind getting to be honest. But when I saw the way she like rocked them and whatever, I was like, I need to get those. I have been absolutely obsessed with her stuff recently. I feel like, I don't know, we just have this connection. We are like, <laughs> she doesn't even know I exist. That's the funny thing. Cause I'm like, I'm obsessed with your style and like all your stuff, but you don't even know I exist, which is kind of weird, but whatever. So next on my little haul video, I got this cute little skirt from River Island. Um, this was actually on sale for I think 160 Rand from 700 I think it is. Guys, if you want to know one thing about me, my second name is actually not Bianca. It's Bargain Hunter. <laughs> I promise you I am always finding good bargains. Like if I find a good bargain, I will like tell people about it. I'm like, look, yeah, you need to go get this. Um, so River Island is having a 75% sale because they're closing down in September. So obviously it's like as time goes on, they're going to have like sales and sales and sales and whatever, whatever. So yeah, they're going to go purely online. I was like, I need to get this skirt. So I got this white one, which is a lot more versatile. And then it's got these buttons, um, these gold detail buttons down the front. So yeah, it's like that button down skirt. And then on the button, it just says River Island. Yeah, I mean, 160 bucks, guys. The eight was a bit too big for me around my waist. And I like things to be high-waisted because I'm short, so it makes me look a little bit taller. Um, so I got this in a size 6 so that it fits nicely around my waist. And yeah, I'm, I think I'm going to wear these with like boots, ankle boots, even high-waisted high -waisted boots. Ankle boots and then even thigh-high boots. Alright, so next on my list is something I literally bought today. And guys... I kind of made a good decision. I'm still like, mm. so I got this jacket. I don't know if you can even see. I'll insert a little clippy of me wearing it. But I got this jacket, really cool jacket. Um, it's a faux suede kind of a vibe and it's got like this buckle detail. It's gray and it's just got buckles and zips and like this cool vibe. I really, really like it. So I saw a baby pink blush, surprise. I saw the blush color like this and I know they have a baby blue one as well. So I saw that and I took a picture of it um, in March and then they ran out of stock and then I thought, okay, they're not gonna come out with it again. Like I guess that was my last chance. So I was like, oh, it was one of those things where it was like, that sucks. And then I moved on. And then today I went to the waterfront with my cousin and I saw the jacket. So I, I took it in pink, I took it extra small in pink and I was like, ooh. But then I saw the grey one and I just felt like grey is more versatile, grey is more like, it's more of a classic colour, she says after she buys a pink coat. It's more versatile, it's more of a classic colour, I can wear it for seasons to come and I am loving this jacket. I love all the detail, um, it's got these buckles and buttons and just it's so cool really so i got this jersey jacket it's actually a like a joke a joke a jacket coat and drill coat so i got this jacket from zando as well it's the brand utopia and online it looked 
really cool like it looked like almost like a fleecy kind of a sheep vibe but then when it got here i was like mm. so yeah i don't like it but i don't like this it's from utopia and i actually asked for, for it to be returned so they should be collecting it tomorrow but i really don't like it and i don't know i just i was i was expecting it to be a bit different if i can be honest with you it's a bit too big because it's a one size fits all so it's a bit too big for me it's a bit too sheepy if that makes sense yeah it's just very sheepish that's not even a word baba black sheep baba white sheep kind of a vibe so the last thing i got was this pair of leather boots so this is from river island i really like this boot it's got buckles it's got zips it's got chains i've been really enjoying this boot but I feel like I bought it in a size too small and because it was a sale item and because I bought it with a gift voucher, I cannot take it back. But it's okay because I'm going to try this thing where you like use newspaper and all of that type of goodness. So I'm going to try and stretch this boot out so that it fits me because I am a size 4 but I feel like I should have taken a 4.5 or a 5. And yeah, I'm, I'm really hoping that I'm not wasting my money on this because... I really like it and it's leather so I want it to work out for me so if you guys have any tips on how to like stretch boots out because I don't know and I've googled it but I'm like, like I don't understand what you are saying so if you have any tips on how to stretch out leather boots please leave a comment down below so I can actually figure this out I've been really liking this boot I think I've worn it like twice or thrice but yeah I like it because of all the chains and all these details it's very different to what I usually buy and I am quite so that is it for my whole video guys i really hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video if you did please give it a thumbs up um also i'm going to be leaving all of the details of the items in the description box and also like maybe if the thing or the item has been sold out maybe i'll find something different i'll link that as well so yeah give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys in my next video bye